What's going on everyone? It's Bruce East Brew, and today I'm on my skiller with a quick loot video covering the loot from 82 to 85 fishing, doing angler fish only. Now 82 fishing in 100% Piscarillus favor is required to fish angler fish. If you're missing the favor, check out my guide on screen now to see how to quickly get that. So overall, this grind was about 800,000 XP total for the three levels combined, and each angler fish only offers 120 XP per, which is barely more than a swordfish, and you fish them much, much slower. Angler fish are one of, if not the slowest fishing XP you can get in game in the later fishing levels, coming in at 10 to 15k XP an hour if you're paying attention. And you can get over these rates with the angler's outfit, the dragon harpoon special, a decent amount of focus, and obviously a higher fishing level. As for my skiller, I was averaging around 10k XP an hour, and sometimes less than that because I'm more focused on my main, so there were times I was getting XP more slowly, but it's pretty much free XP and GP eventually, and as I always say, any XP is better than no XP. So because of this, overall the grind took 100 hours, which was spent over the course of 3 weeks to get to 85 fishing from 82, doing angler fish only. The main reasons you would fish angler fish is for how AFK they are, they're close to a bank, and the fishing spots last a while and are close together. But what makes the slow XP worth it is how profitable angler fish are, with each angler fish hovering around 1.5k usually. So a full inventory is pretty much always over 40k, and this is just a screenshot of them earlier from the GE, and they do fluctuate but they are consistently profitable. And anglerfish also have one of the higher chances at the fishing pet, the heron, but at the cost of how slow they are. And unfortunately, no heron so far on my skiller, but you can see they are pretty common here. So for keeping track of the fish, it was pretty simple. I started coming here fishing anglerfish right at 82 fishing with no anglerfish in my bank. And I banked every single one since starting and have not moved from this fishing area. When I ran out of worms, I would just buy more and go back to fishing. So let's check the loot here and see how much we made. So 6,979 anglerfish from 82 to 85 fishing, only doing angler fish here, so about 7,000, and Runelight is saying it's worth about 9.86 mil for the 7,000 of them, so about 10 mil for 7,000 angler fish. Not bad at all. So let's go ahead and sell them now, just to see how much GP we made. Incredible, very nice. So almost 10 mil made from about 7,000 anglers. We can see here 9.6, almost 9.7 mil was made. I'll probably go ahead and buy a bond with that and keep the extra GP. If you're interested in my skillers stats, here they are. Nothing incredible yet. I'm focusing on fishing and then I'll probably get 99 cooking. After that, I'll move to mining or wood cutting, but that will be a long time in the future. This account is really in it for the long game. You'll notice I do have 11 Slayer as well, and I plan on putting every lamp into that to see how high I can get it. So like I said, the long game. For my next video on this account, I'll most likely be doing loot from 85 to 89 fishing, doing either Temporos or Anglers only. At the moment, I'm kind of leaning towards Temporos, but we'll see. 
And that's going to be it for this video. If you like the video, please comment, like, subscribe, and feel free to check out my other content. I'll see you all soon. Take care. Peace.